people say? How many people, right? When he came on and started doing all that. How many were people, how many people were thinking, if I want to wave flags in my house, I will do. That ginger bug is not gonna stop me. Yeah. You see that there, Dina? Yeah. I've got one just like that on the <laughs> no, seriously I have. Are you just smuggled a cushion from upstairs as well? Yeah. Adam, happy with that? Yeah. Now be honest, when you did it in rehearsal, because we have had a rehearsal, um, you landed a bit funny, didn't you? Yes. I heard you swear. Yes. I'm glad you didn't do that tonight because there's like kids in and stuff. But happy with that one, yeah, much better. Yes, definitely. Shall we find out what the judges think? Yeah. Okay. Kevin? Well, it was really nice tonight to actually have the fire, <laughs> which we didn't have last night, but uh, you know, we could see ahead and see what you could do. It was actually great. Um, I did enjoy what you did, and there is a call and a need for speciality acts. Um, I'd like to have seen you do more tricks with the fire, which I don't know whether you do, but there's lots more tricks. I used to have a friend who was a fire eater, so there's lots more things you can do and make it more spectacular. And um, I'm sure you'll be able to do lots of fabulous work in fakes and things like that, so excellent, yeah? You know when you said you used to have a friend who was a fire eater? Nothing went wrong, did it? Yeah, it sort of went up in smoke. Oh my word. With a puff. <laughs> Adam, it went quite... It is panto, everybody! <laughs> Oh, right. Uh, Georgia, what do you think? Um, I thought it was really exciting and I'm really glad it went well um, for you after the rehearsal. I would say that there was a large section of dance in the middle, whereas what you were doing with the flag and with the fire is actually way more interesting. But it worked as a piece, it was really entertaining and I liked, I liked the fire a lot. But it's right, we would like to have seen a bit more of that. Paul, anything you'd like to add? Well, I saw uh, one of the earliest heats and you didn't do anything with fire at that one. We thought you were great and that's why you got so far tonight. I thought that the fire eating really added something to the act. I think your dancing is super because you, uh, it's all your own work there, isn't it? Yes. Yes, and, uh, and I think integrated together, brilliant. Just before we go any further, Andy, do you do this dancing in your spare no, time? No, no, no. I was going to say, this is what I'd like to learn out of it. Right, uh, okay. You're a crazy man, aren't you? I've seen you backstage and you're quite a scary close-up, but actually, I've got to say, can I ask you the question, do you suffer at all at any point with belly button fluff? Because I guess you probably don't. <laughs> Insofar as you must set fire to whatever's in there each time you do your act. I thought you were great, really entertaining, well done. Adam, are you happy with those comments? Yeah, um, yeah, um. Your makeup's running. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Adam Thornywell! <laughs> Seriously, I, 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 all I've got in my head now is Andy Miller skipping around like Adam just did, <laughs> trying to set fire to himself. And I just, Where do you get matchsticks from like that? I'm not sure. I you really know, I get the cheap that. matches, I light the match, and by the time I get to the candle, it's gone no, out. No, it takes there. years of practice. Hey, next act, you ready for this? Marie Mossin! <laughs> 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 <laughs>